Good morning, everyone. It's Kathy with Plan Happy with me. And if this is your first time here, welcome. Everybody, welcome to my channel. I'm so glad that you're here. Today, I'm showing you kind of a different video because I made this sheet this week quite some time ago. I was practicing with a hybrid planner to see if my Franken planner would work. And I'm excited to say that it does. So we're going to add some dates to this planner and um, then it will be ready to add to my actual planner, put it on the discs. So let's find the dates. I'm thinking this was gray. Do we want gray numbers here? Probably. Let's see. Okay, so this will be Monday the 8th. And let's just see if she has, if I have her, I don't have all of them. Okay, so we'll go to the um, date it books and we'll get out some black ones. Okay, oops. Okay, so let's see. This is the kind of scripty font. Um, those would be okay. Let's use these. Okay. And these are paper, so um, that actually will be better for this application because um, we're kind of just adding to rather than... Um, so let's see. We could put it there or there. I like it there. Okay. This um, is what gave me the idea to see if the big stickers from Mojo would fill in the um, di um, the dashboard planner. And though this is not a happy planner pages, this is a um, hybrid planner from the penny pages, um, this is what motivated me to give other things a try, to use my stash and see if I could create my own, um, let's put this one down here because it's not gonna work. And then this over here totally changed in my Franken planner, but again, it is what inspired me to see if I could make it work. So I think we're just going to put the date over here. Oh, maybe let's go underneath. Let's go underneath. That'll work. That'll work. And then this is the reason why I'm glad these are paper because um, a little more forgiving. I can uh, get a little more done with a little less work. Okay, so that finishes off that page, and this would be the dashboard section of my Franken planner. Goes right into the teacher planner, which again, I need numbers. So I'm thinking, I'm, I'm thinking these should be black also, but I'm going to see if I have them in. Um, Clear, not big, not big, too big. Uh, oh, we have yellow. We have yellow. Yes, there's yellow. See if we like it. Come on. Oh, I think that'll be fine. There's eight. Um, when I first got these, I was like, yeah, you're not splitting these up. If you don't use the whole month, you're not using them. And then I very quickly realized, you know what? That's kind of stupid because you're ending up with a lot of stickers that you're not using. So I kind of broke my rule and it still is hard for me <laughs> to um, break up my stickers, my dates, but I get to use the colors I want to use on the pages I want to use. And I think in the long run it is my planner and if I end up with two or three or four oddball st date stickers at the end well who knows maybe one day I'll have an oddball page okay so that's that page the yellow definitely worked on that page and this is my teacher planner so you know how I work with that this is her academic portion of her uh, kit and then it goes right into the journal you can see I still have notes here 
<laughs> um, I did not put distress in here, so that that might change. I was planning to put it here, but uh, I'll work that out. Um, this is probably that soft geode kit. Um, and then here is, is what I was going with on this was color over theme. So soft geode, and then we go into the bees, and then yellow, and here I used um, wrong wrong. Now this is the deco section, the hourly section, and the journal. So this gets rid of one planner, which was my original idea. Uh, but I didn't like the fact that my journal had no creativity, and so I changed it. But this is going to be for the week of April 8th. Thanks for stopping by. I hope you like this video. I have two more coming out like this later in the year because they were all my, quote, test planners. And uh, they are what sparked me to do what I do now. So you guys have a great day. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye.